what's going on youtube back with another video uh this video today is going to be a quick one all i'm doing is uh changing the, the valve cover gasket and i'm adding okay okay so put my handy dandy gloves on like i say i'm taking this valve cover off i'm taking that cork gasket off and I'm putting a rubber gasket with the steel inside. The way it stays straight when you put it on here. If anybody knows about changing uh, the valve cover gaskets on any vehicle, really, uh, same as oil pan gaskets, if you're installing it dry, it's hard to keep that thing straight until you can get the valve cover on top. And then you have to put the screws through it also. So you gotta go through the cover and a valve cover. Man, that is a lot of work. So, to circumvent that, I have ordered a part. Yeah, so I ordered these bad boys right here. I'm gonna open it up for you so you can see. Now, when you take the screw out of the actual valve cover, it's a bolt. What you do is you replace it with these. You stick this down in there, and then after you put the gasket on and you put the valve cover on, you come back and you just hand tighten these down. This is gonna make it 100 times easier. So, I'm gonna go ahead and get started on that. So I'm gonna go ahead and Pop these out real quick. The good thing about these old trucks is you can stand right inside this joker and do everything you need to do. Or you can sit inside of it however, however you want to do it. Sometimes you don't really have a choice though. Because <laughs> what you're working on is so far towards the back. Be very careful. It's made of plastic. Pull it straight up. Don't wiggle it. Just pull it straight up. If it's not moving, you can ro rotate it to loosen it up and then pull it straight up. Don't wiggle it from side to side because then you'll have to go buy another one. And you know me, I'm all about saving money. Okay, so I have the valve cover off. As you can see, here are all the valves. That's the valve, uh, the PCV. Um, so, yeah, so I'm going to just take this cork gasket off, and I'm going to screw, screw these bad boys down in here. That one in, got that one in, that one in. Now I'm gonna put this last one there. Let's go grab this flathead screwdriver. I'm recording with my hand, or I can move the camera how I want to. I know it's kind of shaky, but all right. So I'm tighten this down. Okay. Here we go. Got that in there. Now I just repeat for the next three. Okay, so now I have to open up these fresh gaskets. Okay, so like I was saying, rubber gaskets with the uh, metal insert on the inside. You can't see it, but it's there. So it just makes it a hundred times better for when you uh, switching these out. Man, this is really on there. I only had this on there about a week, but it seemed like it's been on there forever. I guess these things really do seal up good. 
My finger keep getting in the way. I'm going with my left hand. Okay. All right. So we got that off. this little gasket maker right here off and piece of this cork so I don't mess it up when I seal it look at Prince now he's so hard-headed I told him to stay out that dirt like eight times he don't care I guess he said he won't do what he want to do but I got something for him <laughs> How beautifully that goes on top of there. Yes. Yes. Man, that goes on there so beautifully. Shouldn't have any leaks. Everything nice and straight. Now, put this cover back on. I totally forgot. Oh. Um, to put the, uh, the little valve cover um i don't know what those things call i got it from autozone the other day right here this i got to put these on ah, okay i'm gonna take those back off put these on real quick and then i'll come back to y'all okay y'all so I put them on. I only put them at the bottom. Like I said before, they're only really needed at the bottom because that's where the leaks are going to occur. And then I'm going to put two more on this side at the bottom. So let's get that done. All right, people. So I went ahead and knocked this side out. And that's that. Hopefully, I didn't over tighten them. Let me grab these boots. Definitely don't want that to fall off the engine. Okay, and that's it. Like, subscribe, and share all my skills.